Hello. It is I. Arrow TV. I tried really hard to make it so that my green screen worked, but I record in OBS and I stream in Streamlabs. And for some reason, I am unable to make it even remotely decent. So instead, we shall get Ghost Me today. Now, I'm not going to keep this intro long. I just want you to let you know what the video is all about. Basically, today I went through every single killer one time. I didn't give it a second chance except for Plague because the Plague games were just a bunch of DCs and memeing and trolling and stuff like that, and it just wasn't real games. That actually kind of killed it partially, and I apologize for the times that I am kind of quiet. But I am going to have timestamps down below as to each killer that there is in case you're curious about if you should pick them up or not or how they play. Um, I am a red rank killer 9 out of 10 times except after my more recent uh, YouTube video with Trickster. Unfortunately, I am down to green ranks. However, that is still average. And so you should still be thinking along the lines of if it's average, it works. So... Try to keep an open mind. I hope you enjoyed the video. Let me know what I can do better, what I can do less of. I know that the video became way too long, and I apologize for that, but I really, really appreciate you for checking it out. If you can comment, like, or subscribe, because it's free, it would help me a lot. But at the same time, I'm not doing it for that. I just think this is a lot of fun. To do something that I'm passionate about. So without further ado, let's get into this video. Starting with killer number one and ending with twenty two three whatever. Because this was this was a ride. This was a ride. Alright. Good luck guys. I hope you have a great day. Okay, I don't, I don't know. This is our first game with Trapper. I may have to redo this one because I don't know if I grabbed a uh, Trapper bag. And I do not believe Trapper should not have a bag. One trap being able to be carried around, which is already very weak. Eh, cringe, dude. Super cringe. Um. Anyways, let's get into this game once they finish loading. And uh, let's try our best. Let's see what kind of map we get. All right, Pale Rose, back, Backwater Swamp. Um, I don't know how this is with Trapper. I like the map in general. Um, yeah, we did not grab the bag. Uh, I don't know much about Trapper. We're going to put one there, which is super obvious. I bet you they'll just be able to step over it where I put it anyways. Um, I see someone over here. Oh. Okay, we're gonna. I know someone's. Okay, that's fine. She's gonna cross over panicked. I think we get it down here. Okay. That's fine. Before I go any further, though, she dropped this trap. What I wanna do. Is I want to put this here. I don't know if it'll work or not, but I have that, and I'm going to go back to her. There's someone up there, if you did, if you could see. Okay, it seems like these guys are survivor friends. Dead hard. Yep. And that's fine. I'll take him. Get hard. Uh. 
So now these are survivors that are really, really trying to bully the system and game it as best as possible to their benefit. And it's just really, really obnoxious if we're to be honest. Dead hard. It's it's written. We we've been here. We know it's written. Now we're gonna walk back because they think that I left. Nope. They're just gonna get a trap. They can get off, whatever. Okay, they chose to get him first, and so now they're going up to get her. No dead art on her. Now these guys once again are realizing now that they are against somebody that's not brand new to the game. They are applying a lot of pressure though, so I will give it to them. Well done for the decisive there. He doesn't make it anywhere, even with dead hard. Guess I'll kick this.
Dead hard, dead hard, dead hard. So this is a good first Trapper game. <laughs> I haven't been able to say much because honestly, they've applied a lot of pressure. Um, I wouldn't be surprised if this person has Unbreakable. Or uh, Lucky Break. Or whatever the one is that allows you to... I actually had no clue that he was slug still, so I am so sorry. But anyways, that's how you play Trapper when you have a bunch of asshole players. I mean, not great players. That think that they're better than they are. Now that's one trick I really like to do is when you put a trap behind you when they go to slam the gate, the uh, thing down, but. is. Hey, so there wasn't any audio in which I was speaking because I was kind of surprised during this that they would have an, uh, they would have a problem with the way that I played. But I do want to just interject into this video and say one quick thing. When somebody is upset, just let them be upset unless you're like me and you just love to get a rise out of people. I was at first really confused because I did not know that they were serious. And so I was joking about their rank because I'm rank 12 or 13 at the time. And then I realized shortly after that they were genuinely upset and I should have just defused the situation and left. Um, however, nonetheless, I don't care. Y'all suck. Y'all died. Stop being entitled. Oh my god, people are such idiots, dude. Like, I don't, I didn't, I couldn't play that any differently. I run to the pallet, and what do they do first thing they do? Let's just charge the pallet with the, with the, uh, with the trap on it. And then I stop, and I go to pick them up. Let's grab onto the other trap right next door. Let's try to get in front of him while he's carrying someone. Like, come on, give me a little bit of a break, man. I'm not trying to be a jerk. I play both sides. I try to play fairly. Next up is Wraith. Now Wraith is a ch is a character that I actually don't know much about. There's quite a few killers I don't know about, like Billy Wraith. Uh, we are not playing that disgusting creature. Clown, I'm not great with. I used to like him a lot though. Spirit, I'm bad at. Pig, I'm bad at. Uh, demo, don't really know anything about him. Twins, I played for a daily earlier and that wasn't too bad, but Deathslinger, we're skipping because we already did the Death. Well, maybe we won't because I want to make this one video. Pyramid Head, we're bad at aiming. 
Oni, I used to be good at, but he's kind of annoying with how you have to deal with his loading. Trickster, we absolutely will play a couple games of. And so here's the thing. This is going to be a longer video. And it's going to be a longer video because I want to give it an, a good game or two with the character, depending how it goes. Trapper, I think that was a solid game, a solid DBD experience, if you will. Nonetheless, let's go Wraith. And I will, uh, I will um, see you as soon as we get back. Okay, here we are. We are on the Swampy Swamp. Oh, wow. You go really fast in this. Um, let's see if we see anybody over in this way. See if, do we trigger their crows? I don't think I've heard them. I think that was me. <laughs> I think it was me. I uh, I think I'm hearing things. All right, let's go this way. Oh, I hear something. Okay, so we have Thanatophobia. We're not gonna go for her, but we are gonna go for this. Oh, I guess we're going for her. She has to take a hit here. Yep. We're not going to commit to her, though. We're just going to go right back to this one. Because now we have Thanatophobia going into play. And uh, Nurse's Calling could also really, really come in clutch, depending on the situation at this point. You know what I mean? I wish we kind of had Ruin, but Ruin isn't a necessity. It's not a staple that you absolutely must have. If she's not going to go anywhere specific, then we're going to just keep chasing her down this way. What the f- Did I just get spun? I got spun. I got- I missed! <laughs> okay, that's fine. So they're leaving her on the hook, which is kind of a weird thing, because I was being- I was on chase for a while, and now this one's coming for the pallet save instead of the on-hook, which is another weird decision by them. Um... Nonetheless, I'm now going to go over to the other hook because they're almost in second phase. There's no reason for me not to. I should be taking a free hit. This is something that people that are that play only Survivor are going to be like, wow, that's really disgusting. But the truth is, you didn't give me much of a different option to go with. You waited until I already had downed another person, and then you... All right, Claudia, here we go. And then you were unable to uh, really take the aggro. You shouldn't have had to take the aggro is what I'm saying. In the future, go for the onhooks when possible as soon as possible. I, do I barbecue? Oh, no, I don't. Okay. That makes sense. <laughs> I looked around. I'm like, where is everybody? Um, oh. Oh, for some reason, I thought I saw something. Now let's see, what do we got here? Nothing. Nothing. Now, the only thing I can think of is that there is... Which one? So... This girl just um, did her Zorina move that makes it so that she's able to heal the other person's life point or life state once. We're going to commit to this Meg. There's no reason not to. Not in the position she's in. If she was in a more secure position, maybe, but meh. It's a Meg. 
Oh yeah, I don't know if you've heard about it, but how are you feeling about the idea of uh, the uh, updated character models? Because I think that they're kind of interesting. I'm not sure if I think that it's a good interesting, but it is interesting. Now these people have completely given up. Their soul is gone. But that's not my... So, okay. Um, I'm trying to think who it is. J-Roar? I think it's J. Um, when I started, when I started playing Killer, the, my my biggest problem always was that, wow, I do not want to make them have a bad time. But Jay made a really, really good point on his stream once, which shout out to Jay, by the way. And it's, it's not my job to make sure everybody has fun. It really isn't. Okay, I'm having fun. I'm enjoying my time. And if they don't enjoy their time, they can leave. And to be completely frank, it's something I've been really picking up on. I try not to tunnel. I try not to camp. But if they don't leave the if they don't leave it, it's not like I should just let them be there forever. If they're healing in front of my face, it's not like I should just let them heal in front of my face. The one thing is though, my rank is incredibly low after doing the trickster challenge, and I understand that. So this isn't going I'm probably gonna do this again in the future. Except with higher ranks. Because, um, yeah, obviously this isn't the best accurate, uh, representation. Oh, I like that. I like I like that a lot. That was really cute. That is really freaking adorable, I tell you what. Um Seven. I'm just gonna put seven down so that I could go back to that. <laughs> Holy crap! I want I want that to be my uh, ringtone. <laughs> wow! Look at her. She's speedy. Oh, uh, my, my elbow itches really, really badly right now, and so I'm using the corner of my desk. Who she does? Here we go. Oh no, she missed she missed it. I'm gonna let the last one go. Actually, I'm gonna let the Meg wiggle off and then I'm gonna kill the Claudette. Cause she's at the boat right now. And I'm going to kill her because I think the Meg is a baby baby. The way that she's moving, she's running into the walls and everything. Um, I prefer to take it out on the, uh, the Claudette that seems like she might be knowing what she's doing. What are you doing down here? Yeah, she knows what she's doing because you go into the basement for items. Like, I mean, obviously, it's not like, a, ooh, wow, she's perfect, but she knows what she's doing a little bit more. And she's trying to be a blender. Yeah, she can, she can go to the next one.
Now we're gonna watch her in case she Kobe's. We watch them in their habitat. Is this poor soul gonna come and try to save them or something? Why is she not trying to wiggle? Oh my gosh, the new wiggle bar when you go into second phase. Ah, finally. Finally, am I right? There we go. Hmm. Yeah, this is a really pretty map. I know that's a weird thing to probably say, but they did a pretty good job as to like making it a uh, one for one ratio of a Shrek swamp. I know I don't think they get enough credit for that. I wonder if the Meg is like over here still. Just working away on this. No. She might know her hatches. She definitely deserves hatch though. Sorry about the low quality game. Definitely not the same caliber as last uh, team. Can it spawn inside the boat? Hatch on this map. Okay, so there's the Meg. I think she's aware. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go into this. I haven't yet. Oh yeah, there's this area too. Hmm. They need to work on this. They're gonna have hatches that. Oh.
Ah, uh, she didn't even know which way to go with it. That's adorable. I'm glad she got out. With next. Okay. So. Uh, so our next set, we will be getting... Not the greatest, not the greatest. Okay. So, we did Wraith. Let's do Billy. Let's see what we have. We have... Whispers, Tinker, Nurses, and uh, Ruin. Let's see if... do Is there anything we can swap Nurses for? Um... Hmm. I almost want to swap it out for Lightborn. I just wish it was Shadowborn. <laughs> um, we could do a really weak Pop Goes the Weasel build. Uh, considerably reduces the time penalty when bumping into OK. Um, what does this do? Change less sound for sweat now. Continue change less spent sprint after breaking a pallet or wall. Survivors hit with a chainsaw within five seconds of breaking a pallet or wall are damaged for a single health. Tremendously increases steering while using the chainsaw, considerably increases the time penalty. Okay. That with this might be helpful, right? Moderately decreases chainsaw charge time, reduces base movement speed. You know what? Let's go with this. I know it seems silly, but I'm not... I don't know how to play Billy. Moderately increases the chainsaw rate of cooling when a flashlight is shining. It. That's kind of weird. That's very specific. Um, moderately increases move speed during a chainsaw spin. Slightly increases chainsaw time. That's whatever. Okay, I think this is good. Let's ready up. And let's go to Jigsaw. <laughs> just, I'm just kidding. I'm no, don't worry, don't worry. I'm not that bad. Yeah, I'm not that bad. I was kind of hoping that we had a cold wind farm. Oh, wait, I think they've actually disabled cold wind farm at the moment anyway, so it wouldn't matter. Um, let's bring a cypress. Now, you know what's weird is that the cypress seems so weak, but at the same time, there's been many times where everybody gets out and the last person is, like, at the exit gate and about to get out, and you are able to cypress them instead of having to carry them away when you would lose them otherwise. Anyways, I will do a little bit of a clap of the hands, and once we're in game, I will bring us right back. Okay, um, and here we are. Okay, yep, 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 there we go. All right, so please don't make fun of me too much, okay? My Billy's bad. I don't know how to curve. I don't know what I'm even doing. Um, so give me a break. Oh, that was close. Nice. We got one. I think that's the first chainsaw kill I've ever gotten in this game. Aside from Bubba. I really like Bubba. Alright, so one down. Let's go this way see if we can do a Pop Goes the Weasel maybe on the uh, gas station. Nope, nothing there. So the nerf to uh, Billy is the, he can't just chain forever, right? <laughs> can't turn like that. <laughs> like, cause I do see the red meter going up. It doesn't seem that big of a deal. Ah, shoot. Taki mother. Okay. Oh, yeah, we still got ruin going, too.
And mind you, I'm willing to do all this challenge without using add-ons or anything like that. I just think the add-ons kind of just add a little bit of flair to the game. I think they're fun. Um, so I tend to use them. But if that cause if that's a problem, then um, I can definitely reevaluate it. All right, I don't want to really camp, so I'm gonna go this way. Well, you got it. I mean, I can't, I can't blame you. You know, you, you did get it. God, can you imagine that? You're just, you're working on a generator. Some crazy, oh, what the, f some crazy guy with a chainsaw just comes in, and you're just like, you know, might as well finish. It's all in a day's work. Hey, by the way, in case you care, I just got 99 magic on uh, RuneScape. You're, wel you're welcome for sharing that. Uh, uh, I know nobody cares about that, but you know, I'm pretty happy. Now I can stop paying attention to this to the side and everything to alt, F, alt uh, tab and I can press escape. Damn. Ah, uh, she waited right there, huh? Oh no, I think she went right at the back. Well done. I don't think I'm good enough to get around this area too well. I need to let my chainsaw cool down a little bit. Just kidding, let's go, let's get it! Let's get it! Dark Angel of 84, more like Dead Angel of something. <laughs> I probably made her crap her pants, I'll be honest with you. Bada bada bottom, ba bada bada ba, ba bada bada ba, ba bada bada ba, ba 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 ba
Okay, we got the uh, blue man, uh, blue man group actress. Ah. Uh. Oh. There we go. Jeez. Um. Jeez. Um. I'm not playing my trickster game. I can smack you. You know, Billy's kind of fun. I'm going to be honest with you. I'm having a blast with this. That's right, that's what I thought. That's what I thunketh. Is there even a hook anywhere near you, or are you just gonna get a free escape? I don't know where this uh, Death Angel of 84 is, though. Oh, there it is. We go. There's a 4K for you, bud. Again, not the best players in the world. I'm sorry, but you know what? They're not bad. And these are the average type of players and slightly above average players that you're going to be facing. So there's the Billy game. Next up is, uh, what? Um, I don't know, but we'll, I will let you know once we are there. Thank you guys uh, for sticking through this far. Let's just quickly check the end game chat to see what's going on. This is rank 12. Uh, so we got 27k. Uh, no, they're not going to be able to talk. Okay. Uh, so our next character is going 
to be nurse awesome okay and i will let you know once we're in our perks and everything else something i kind of wish i was doing through this video was telling you the backstory of these but like i think nurse for example um no not nurse uh, ghost face for example it's just it's a lot to read and i don't think many people care so i think i'm gonna do a reading session at some point but anyways we'll see you once i'm in with nurse let's get going all right seven seconds okay this is one of my most preferred builds and it's super accessible it requires a yellow and it requires a gray add-on the gray add-on shows you exactly where you are blinking to because i don't like to play nurse 24 7. and i don't i don't i know you don't have to to be good with nurse i get it okay some people are just naturally gifted i am not however the showing where the blink is allows you to get pinpoint accuracy on things so we run i'm all ears so that if they do a fast fault in our location their outline is there for a while and the, what this allows us to do is to use the gray add-on to put us exactly on them without any sort of like delay without any sort of oh no i might need to do a second blink to fix it type thing and i know that it's easy to fix those type of things but it's just nicer it feels more fluid the yellow one is just there because it, it, re, it uh, gives us some faster recharge time and it, you really can't have too much recharge time. Now, one thing going into this game I do want to mention is that Nurse plays very differently than any other killer. Loops is something that does not exist for uh, Nurse. Same with Spirit in a, in a different extent, I guess you could say. But Sp Nurse specifically can just blink through the wall that you're hiding behind. And do I think this is fair? Absolutely not. Do I think Nurse is fair? I kind of do. And the reason being is because her she requires so much skill. Yeah, and I'm not saying, oh, I'm going to be skillful if I get a 4K. No, absolutely not. There are times you get really lucky. Um, I played her for a while. I might be decent at her, but I don't even... It's been a while since I played her. I might not be able to even kill a single person or hit anyone, and sometimes it's really frustrating. But the thing is, she is somebody that you can't just go from playing her for a night to another killer and then going right back to her and thinking you're going to be able to do what you want to do because she is somebody that needs investment. Mount Ormond Resort let's go i hope i can show you exactly what nurse does so we have infectious fright because we want to be able to um see there's that there's that gray charge again see without that i might have landed on the ground uh we have whispers so we know someone's in this area they almost always come from outside a lot of the times they're over there at that generator but it's very very possible that they are inside uh, Whispers is gone, so no. Let's go this way. Whispers is back. There's... We found someone. Okay, so now we're gonna go over here. So one, one thing that you want to do as a nurse is after you, uh... After you... Uh, blink on someone swinging kind of like a circular motion into the direction you think that they're going to be going because when you are doing that it allows if they're trying a 360 or spin that you will still most likely hit them it doesn't always work it absolutely doesn't but you never know another small tip that you might have just seen there is that when you are teleporting which i probably saw somebody in just in blind when you are teleporting through a bu buildings like this, you can kind of look around to see what's going on, where you're going, and what there is just, you know, what you can do. Let's go back upstairs, and let's look down at that. Let's see if they went back, if they got greedy. It doesn't look like it, but we do have someone right uh, here. Are they here? I'm so lost.
If you threw fireworks down, that's fine. Okay, again, I messed up there. Dropping a pallet does not do that much against a nurse unless you are to stun them, and stunning them is incredibly risky. I really did not think I had to teleport through that wall. This person is playing this very, very well because they did I'm all ears though. I, I guess I suck. Um, we are able to see them there briefly. We're going to drop. She knows how to play versus me and I am, I feel like I might be tilting myself by chasing her. Okay. I thought, okay. Now let's try seeing how it goes. We have not accomplished anything this game. And sometimes that happens. You have to understand that sometimes you just have bad games and that's okay. That's literally part of the game. Not everybody can always have fun. Because, uh, well, not everybody can have fun because I'm still having fun because I'm learning, right? But I mean, like, not everybody can be winning. Otherwise, what's the point? See, right there, I did, like, a circle because I knew that she was going to be somewhere in that area, but I couldn't tell where. I'm not able to land these uh, blinks today. Okay, so she's gonna bring me back to the LT wall, I think. We need to gain distance. There we go. So we got A down, but there's one generator left, which is really unfortunate. Um, they definitely have won this one by a large margin. But see, that's the thing. Sometimes you just can't win. And it's okay not to win, guys. What is winning in my book? Winning is learning something. And what have I learned? I've learned that I am absolute garbage at this video. <laughs> I have learned that uh, I need more practice on nurse. That's what I've learned. And that's about it. These, these people played immaculably. And by that, I mean, they just were at the right places at the right times. Nice. I bet you, I bet you her pants are wet. Well, it doesn't matter what her pants are doing. I bet you I scared the crap out of her though. We don't need to hit this. I don't think it's really going to accomplish much, but there we go anyways. Okay. Okay. That timing was perfect. This is when I wish I had no Ed. Mm. 
let's see if I can get him. Come on, come on out, my dears. Come on out. Come on out, my dears. You know you want to. Alright, GG's. I was kind of hoping one would go through. I wasn't gonna, um... I didn't know that you could do that. I wasn't going to, uh... Kind of, like, camp or anything. Well, I mean, I was camping, but I wasn't gonna just, you know... Let them... From a bug. <laughs> but, anyways, that's the nurse game. None of these are... Not all of these are gonna be bangers. Not all of them are gonna be great. But, I hope that you enjoyed it nonetheless. Uh... Sorry to disappoint you, but I'm not the greatest ever. I know it's crazy. I'm consistently average. But this person is just going to be waiting for, I guess, most likely teabagging or hatch. Um, so with that, we're going to just skip right up into the next character. Let's go. I right, listen. Listen. All right, we can't always do the best of the best, all right? Nurse didn't go well. I know it could do better. Maybe we'll have a little bit of a bonus section, maybe in a different video, because this one's going to be long as heck. But Huntress is next, and Huntress was my baby for a while as well, but I might as well not say that because, you know, how it is. It's just, I say it, and I curse myself. Uh, let's go with that, and, you know, I kind of like this. This is kind of a cute look, right? And we'll just grab the savage battle axe, whatever. Let's ready up. Let's do our best. Now, loadout. <clears throat> what is this? Considerably decreases hatchet wind up time. 10% hatchet flight speed. Sure. Oh, it looks like I was trying to go for uh, Adept Huntress, which I do believe I unlocked. I, I'm not 100%, but I do think so. So I'm going to go Nurses. I'm going to go Whispers. I'm going to go Barbecue. And Pop? Let's... Let's look around real quick to make sure that's what I want. Um, yeah, I guess that's. I don't. Uh, I don't need it. Um. Oh, hold the farm. Let's go there. I don't care if it's not the greatest map. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I'll let you know once we're in the game. Ah, da, 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 da. Dude, this map looks so good now. I love it.
Hmm. Oof. I think it's more fun trying to actually go for the challenging shots than to just go in M1. Except for those situations. This is also an infinite loop, so I have to break the door. And I think there's another one actually they put right here. Nope, they fixed this one, okay. Oof. Too high, I haven't played Huntress in forever. Man. Wow. Really? That didn't hit? Oh my good lord. Alright, we need to start being dirty. We need to start being disgusting. Look away, children. This is a rated... This isn't even rated R. This is rated X. And I bet you, you don't even know what that means. And if you do, well, maybe you should keep it to yourself because there's children here. Alright, let's go. Uh, What's up here? Anybody... Any humans? Any humaners? Bet you they're working on this one. Nope. Okay. I really want to get some sexy shots in, but I'm not aim- I, I have no aim what? right now. Okay, wonderful. Great job, Michael. Absolutely wonderful. Oh! Bam. Left to right, left to right, there you are. There we go. Not great shots, mind you, but they're shots. I'm gonna pretend to grab that. Now we will. Now we have pop. Hopefully we can get to that in time. Nice, dead hard. Get dead hard? No.
Now you can say whatever you want about the way I play my hunches, but I can tell you one thing. I get them kills. I get them kills. I just saw Crow. What the hell is a hook? This was not the closest hook. I don't even know if I make this. So stupid. I don't know why I couldn't find a hook over there. That was weird. Oh well. Actually, you know what? I don't need to do anything fancy. We can just chase after her now. We should have popped that, but I felt like that was a really good opportunity. We have one person going over there. I wonder if, yeah, they know about it. You also have to go one of two ways. I think you just die here. I don't know what that was all about. That was awfully silly. So yeah, not the most impressive experience again. And I apologize guys, I can't always do so great. I'm trying to get a video out that kind of shows, you know, an average play of throughout the day. Nothing amazing, nothing bad. Just, you know, there, if you will. Might be able to get one more out of this, actually. Oh, no. Why did the scratch marks disappear? That was weird. Oh well, it is what it is. I could have camped. I could have made sure I got two kills, but I don't want to play like that. I got a brutal killer, and at the end of the day, brutal killer means that everybody kind of walks away happy, except it just doesn't feel like a win, obviously. It's a rank 1 4 4 4, and I'm a rank 12. I can only do so much. Cold wind farm is not the greatest because of the corn. Nonetheless, I'm not gonna make any excuses. I need to get better and also I was a rank 1 huntress So there is no excuse whatsoever with the ranks. I'm just very rusty Next killer. Let's see what we got 
So we're going from Huntress, and we, now we are going to... Myers, okay. Wanna see something cool about Myers? <laughs> I'm bloody Myers. All right, so what's up? I am dumb and recorded the Myers game completely muted. So I am redoing it now. To the best of my abilities, we are running Shadowborn 15 extra field of view. Barbecue and chili so we can find people after we hook them. In fact, it's a phrase so that when we stab somebody and down somebody, they yell. Save the best for last so that if we hit somebody that is not our obsession or our uh, cooldown or our melee is faster or whatever. I don't know. People say it's good. I like it sometimes, but usually I just end up hitting the obsession and losing anyways. We bring in more because we want to mori as many people as possible. And uh, the offering, the um, add-ons are just, you know, they... They do stuff. Not sure what. Unless let's hope for a good game. Yo, here we are again on Yamayoka, Yamiyoka State Family Residence. We got our Mori, they've got their blood points and another offering, and we are going to go Yam Yamayoka, Yamoka. Uh, I'm sorry if I'm saying that incorrectly, but we are Myers and we are looking to stab somebody. Anybody. There has to be someone over here, right? Do you think he knows? Oh, he knows. Another person over there. What is this, a Jake outfit? See if he goes this way. We got him here. Three gens are done already. I've barely done anything on the map yet. Nice. That's all right. We can still come back. We are Myers and we have almost tier three. Let's just go to the generators, I guess. I, I like to be able to travel around the map, but it kind of sucks. So. Four gems are done.
Let's pick up you first in case of unbreakable. Kick this just to reset it. This stressful game, they popped all gens so quickly. They have to be on that gen. Nope, there's inside the building. Fortunately, these are pretty good players, um, and they just were able to hold on to one button and repair the generators, and that's just how it goes sometimes. But this is kind of the idea of what Myers does. He uh, he stalks people, and then he um, he sometimes kills them, but for the most part, they don't really care. There's no way they're leaving him behind though. Okay. 
See if we can time this right. We don't want to let her get too close. I don't see him on the ground anymore. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is how you play Myers. He had a key. I should have stayed on them. Oh well. Now that the game is solidified, I am satisfied to put this into the video. Thank you again, guys, for sticking through it. I know it's a lot, but I appreciate you. Yeah, okay, sorry, I changed hockey. Trying to get used to the fact that there's hockey. This map's okay. I'm not a fan of it. I don't know what it is aesthetically, but the rain is absolutely beautiful. So what I like to do is I like to go into a kind of a weird corner and do that. I don't know why I didn't hit them. I can see them clearly. And we're gonna do that. We're gonna, we're just gonna hit her. We're just gonna hit her, scare it. Uh, that's not gonna reach. I don't know why I tried. We're just gonna have to chase her. Really? Okay, God pal out of the way. Not bad. <laughs> I don't know why that's not triggering anybody. That's such weird. That's weird. We're gonna kick this and hope overcharge pops in. Just heard someone. 
I don't really do much though. I might redo this one because my eyes are really bad with this color. And I don't know what's going on, but I can't find a single person. Oh, it's because they're all hiding. Okay. Now I understand. Never mind. We don't have to redo this one. I thought it was like bugged and there was only one person in the whole lobby. I think they're all running comp spirit and I think that's really throwing me off and confusing me. So I need to rely on my eyes only. Weird. Really, really weird. Kind of sucks too, I'm not gonna lie. Now, see, the thing is, I don't want to camper and I don't want to put her to death, but I want the people that I cannot find because of, I assume, calm spirit and iron will to feel pressured into trying to help this person for feeling bad. I will not be, maybe I'll slug her, but I will not uh, put her back on the hook until I feel like it's necessary. So now I know somebody's there and there's probably two. Yep, see, there we go. She doesn't make it back in time. Yep, calm spirit, iron will. Very good, but very annoying. And honestly, this is the only thing I can really do. I know it's scummy. I just don't know what else I'm supposed to do.
Because of the unhook, I know the decisive isn't there. I'm not gonna go for very long because what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna drop back down because I think the other one's gonna be here. I don't think she's that hard. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go up on this and then we're gonna drop down on them. Hello, buddy. Well, I haven't even seen you yet, I don't think. Well, I guess they got me in the end. It's so unsatisfying. GG's guys, GG's. And that's a doctor game.
Hey, next up. What is after Dr. Uh, Clown? No, Clown? No. No. Bubba, let's go, dude. Let's go. Wait a minute. I, I need to just one second. I'll be right back. There's there's a weird thing going on with my game. All right, so our next killer is um in a sweet old lady that has just kind of gone off her rocker a little bit. But remember, she is she is human just like us. Don't worry about the you know the flesh that's falling off her face, or the mallet, or the chainsaw. Or the massive we um any day now I'll just skip to one sorry game here's old granny let's go boy about to have fun okay uh those three are corrupted let's Let's go middle and then look around a little bit. There might be some people over here, actually. Let's go over here first. Hmm. I thought that was a scratch mark. Uh, I'm not seeing anyone, so I'm gonna head back over this way. I'm gonna check this hill. Hmm. They're about to pop a gen, I don't know which one. Not that one. No. Maybe they're waiting out corrupt. All right, let's uh, let's push them. Let's be aggressive. Hmm, not in there. We're running out of time. But going between those three spots weren't really doing much. They might be just looking for chests at the moment. Do you think they'd be crazy enough to go into the basement? And the answer is yes. The answer is always yes, you know? That's understandable. <laughs> you near someone up here. Let's see how she does. Not bad.
I didn't look around for barbecue whatsoever. So that's kind of a fault of my own. Hmm. I wonder if they're going to come from like this direction. Because they popped that. Hey. You see that crow land? There they are. That's something you always need to be looking out for. Crows landing means that they're coming back and crows that are flying away means that somebody uh, just disrupted them and are in that area. Now, does that mean I'll be able to find them again? No, probably not, but... There we go. Granny is back in business, I tell you what. I don't even see anyone. They might all be hiding. 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 Did you hear her? I don't even think that's the one I heard. <laughs> Sorry, I had to answer a response there because there's a video that I want to make about a uh, game, not in DVD, of course, and uh, I was trying to figure out if the music was able to be used or not, but it looks like you can't. Which has always been a weird thing for me. Oh, I don't know if I make that. There we go. Okay, that should be all taken care of. I apologize for that. It's been a long day of this stuff. I'm having a blast though, going through all the characters that I never really thought I'd use. Now, nah, Bubba, I have a soft spot in my place for. I liked Bubba before his rework, but after his rework, I think he's just really fun. I know people are upset because Hillbilly got the shaft, and I completely understand that uh, Bubba became just as good, but, um, actually what I should say is he's become far better, but, uh, I don't necessarily, oh, I messed up.
I think I kind of like the fact that there's someone simple that's very strong. Um, I know how to use them, and other people do too. And it's not somebody that's like impossible to get into, but at the same time, he's satisfying. And I think that's a good thing to have in DBD because there's just there's a lot of stuff that's just. It's tiring. You watch people play it. You watch uh, all these people do all these crazy things, and in the end, they get the same goal and the they get the same sort of response as if they didn't do anything special at all. Whoops! As if they just were to go and M1 somebody, you know. So it's not really worth it in that sense. By the way, guys, guess what time it is? Ba 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 time. I see someone right there. I'm coming for you. Messed up the window, the door again. She'll drop this, right? No? Wow. That's wild to me. Are you on, are you on, no, you're not on death. Okay, maybe that, that kind of makes sense a little bit more. So let's hook her, let's find the Cheryl, and let's just try to get this game wrapped up. I know I played kind of scummy this game, but you know, sometimes you just gotta do what you gotta do. No Cheryl. I don't hear her breathing over there. Oh, that that crow. So she was coming from over there. Is that her? I'm gonna chase her and uh, see if I can find her. Now this is the most disgusting thing you're ever gonna see. The most disgusting mur- Fucking- You whore. You absolute wh You whore. You abhorrent human. You absolute degenerate. I can't believe you gave her bar time.
I thought we were friends. So we have whispers. I think she's over on the other side. <clears throat> I don't think we'd make that on time either. That's a really, really far distance. No. Head back again. No, head back again. We'll see that we'll find them. I'm looking for crows as well, but I'm not quite seeing them. I think my eyes are kind of itchy, so. It's hard to see those parts of, <laughs> you know, it's hard to see that stuff. Let me know if you've seen any uh, crows go off. I don't know if this person maybe just gave up, doesn't want to give the last kill. <gasps> Ooh, you chose this one. I see that. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is how you play Grandma Bubba. There we go. Oh god, don't look don't look at the ranks. Let's go. Let's just keep going. It's the next character. Let's see what it is. The nightmare. Gotcha. Our loadout's gonna stay the same. Pop, nurses, corrupt, barbecue. I know, it's boring. It's just, it's what I like. You're gonna have to deal with it. Alright, so you know the usual happens. Somebody didn't connect. Why? Yada, yada, yada. Alright, so we're Friday. Let's look at our loadout one more time. Pop, bamboozle, corrupt, intervention, barbecue, and chili. In case you don't know what they are, let's run them down real quick. Pop goes to the weasel 25%. After we hook somebody, we can destroy a generator. We absolutely blow it up. Uh, bamboozle makes us so that we can go really speedy fast over vaults, which isn't really that fast at all. But at least, uh, you know, no survivors can go through it for 16 seconds, which... Honestly feels like a decade to them and I promise you even though it seems like to go by quickly for a killer It goes by forever for a survivor Corrupt intervention because well, you know um, Sometimes you just need to get an intervention in your life and in this case It's the one that makes it so that three generators furthest from you are blocked off the you have there's a lot of map to travel You don't want to have to deal with those furthest ones 
take a little gander, take a walk around town and just see what there is in store that's not, you know, having an entity blocking force for no that just doesn't want to stay forever, but only for 127, whatever. And barbecue and chili because we're absolutely starving and it shows people on the map for four seconds. That's basically. But also, um, I'm more interested in the fact that we get the maximum 100% blood points. Each uh, unique survivor that we hook, you get 25% blood points. If you are new, invest in this perk. It will make your life so much easier because you have no idea how much, how long and how much I have spent playing this game. And yet still, I am starved for blood points to make out characters. We're going to bring Ebony Memento Mori because, honestly, if you die twice the third time, just enjoy it. Just enjoy dying. Unicorn block after survivor interacts with Dream Snare or Dream Palette, which is going to be a Dream Snare because Dream Palette's a garbage. The survivor suffers from the blindness status effect for 60 seconds. What does blindness do? I don't know. It doesn't make them blind, but it does something. So it's a green perk, so probably something good. Uh, yellow increases dream projection power recovery speed for each survivor in the dream world. Now, I was looking at this before, and I think I have a green one of it. Moderately increases dream projection power recovery speed for each survivor in the dream world. Bam. I don't even know what that means, but it's green. So let's go. Let's get this. Let's check our cosmetics. Wow. Wow, wow. Okay, cool. Um, well, you know what we can do is maybe we can Yo, what's up? Okay, we're here. Hawkins Lab was our offering because I just wanted to change up the maps. Um, our build goes as follows. Bamboozle, not the greatest for Hawkins. I probably should have thought that through. Corrupt intervention. Three of the furthest uh, generators are blocked off for 120 seconds. And, of course, members. And, um barbecue and chili so that when we hook someone we can see people for four seconds a certain direction away yes yeah, guys in the infinite loop i'm just gonna break the two uh pallets this is a stupid dumb area that they need to revisit in this map. But nonetheless, uh, maybe I'm just bad. Mind you, I play this a lot, so like, even if I am bad, other people have it worse. I say that and I just lost that person out of nowhere because I'm an idiot. I'm gonna put this right down in the middle of the everywhere. Yeah, there's another one. Okay, we're gonna ignore that pallet. It's not safe. There's no reason to waste time breaking it. That's another thing you need to pick up on pallets that need to be broken and pick up on pallets that don't need to be broken. There's a pallet in here that needs to be broken, but only if she goes from the other direction. Uh, the only other option she had there was going for the window, which would have been a medium vault, which at the speed that I was going at behind her, there was absolutely no way that she would have been able to get a medium vault out away from me without taking a hit and going down. These are things that you need to keep in, um, keep in your mind at all times as things that most people will not say but it just happens naturally something that you pick up on it's kind of something you feel for uh i'll probably be making a video on some of the smaller things just like a kind of like beginner's entry sort of idea hmm Go for the save or something. What the heck? This guy is one of the safest Davids I've ever seen.
Nothing wrong with being a safe David, mind you. It's just surprising. Because usually Davids are pretty, uh... Trying to get in your face. Because they haven't done any gens yet, I just wanted to break that. I see scratch marks here. I'm just going to quickly check. Nope, nothing's right here. And we're going to put one right here. Hit her. There goes the gen. Where was that? I couldn't even tell. She wasn't in Dream World, okay. I don't know if this is the person I just hooked or not, and I'm kind of confused about the new timers. If you look at the left, there's like a yellow timer, and I'm not quite sure what that does. I actually should have let him drop that on me so that area is a dead zone. Aw, oh, maybe she will. Nah, she's just gonna book it. She doesn't make it anywhere. I mean, if he just wants to waste time, that's fine. He's not doing anything for his team. And I'm gonna bring her all the way to the basement. Let's go. No, let's not go to any of them right now. Let's kind of take our time. Let's just go around and see what's going on. I'm sorry, am I tunneling? <laughs> the other David just goes into safe zones and doesn't want to take a hit, so I don't know what to tell you. Probably like right over here, too. Oh, let's break the. Let's get David. Interesting. He doesn't make that. That hard.
Hmm, okay. So I got the David. Everybody's been hooked. I, I wish it told us a hook counter for our side. Just so that we don't, like, completely camp and tunnel people. Like, if we're chasing someone, it's like, oh, you hooked them twice. And it's like, well, okay. Is there a generator right here? Oh, there is. Probably went back over to that one. Now we're gonna go back. And we're gonna smack her. He kind of does the same trick every time. He drops and then he just keeps running. It's good to that's good to remember. His name Nasty Crime Child. He plays really well. <laughs> now watch this. I bet you there's someone already coming for him. I'm not a dirty camper, I swear. Ooh, hi. There's someone going down. Maybe we can hit one of them. Let's see, where is everybody hiding?
He played well. He should get out. Can everyone else leave though, please? But yeah, this is Freddy. He's not bad, he's fun. Take my 1k if I will. What a great last game uh, for the video. Since our last Freddy video well, it got scuffed. Good game. Okay, so we're in the lobby. Uh, I it's kind of hard because I don't have a good next tree to really choose from for her, but I am going to make it so that it's easier for me to put on traps and um, it takes them a little bit more time. I'm going to bring in the exhaust effect because that's always annoying. The Mori so we can try to see it. Uh, whispers because I feel like that's necessary. Haunted grounds because why not? pop and bamboozle um my idea is just basically to try to kill as many people as possible and go for as many chases as possible i don't know if i can really pull off the whole jukey stab moves that people can do um but i'm gonna try my best and i think i just saw at the very last second four items on their team which is something you never want to see but nonetheless here we are here we go. I think we can do it. Our goal is two, but we want all four. Oh my god, I just realized that I forgot to do my dailies in Genshin Impact. Oh my god. Oh, I think I have an hour left. Okay, so I'm going to have to take a break of doing this entire grind fest and get up, up on that. Alright, no big deal, no big deal. Alright, let's... Let's, uh, so we're gonna, I think what the plan is you walk until you see whispers and then you crouch and you try to get an idea of which one they might be at. They're all, they're like always over here though. So like, do I even need to crouch? I am full of crap. Apparently they're never over here. I'm a liar. Like always. So let's go this way. Let's see. They don't ex there is not a single player on this map. That's not even 30 meters. Oh. Okay, well, I'm bad.
How many times do you think I can land this? I'm thinking maybe one. I don't think he's got a pal here. No, he doesn't. We still have haunted grounds. Which is good. We still got bamboozle for killer shack, which is also good. Uh, this is worth doing. I swear I just heard someone over here. I'm just gonna leave her on the ground. We're gonna bring her as far as possible away from any <laughs> any sort of like head contraptions, just to make sure. Okay. I've had people say that I'm a nice killer. Okay, so I just saw scratch marks over here. Hopefully they don't destroy this. Yeah, okay.
Maybe they just kept running this way. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Here's more. Look at her go. There she goes. I miss her so. <laughs> like it's better. <laughs> she been gone. <laughs> She is a cunt. She deserves it. And that's two of them. They probably just find Hatch and get out and bust those in. So. Why does it sound like someone was breathing right there? Hmm. It keeps sounding like someone's breathing for me for some reason. I mean, it must be in my head, but dang, dude. Oh. Let's see how you do. She's had a few good moves. But that wasn't one of them.
no, 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 Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. No, 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 Fine, don't take out. What's our next killer? Uh, we got Amanda down. Who is it? Clown. Clown halfway? Just about, yeah. All right, clown it is. Oh, wait, I should check my loadout, huh? Pop, barbecue, bamboozle, craft. Wow, I have such an amazingly different abattoir of just loadouts. Holy crap, I use the same garbage for everybody. Holy. I think the problem is, though, I really just don't get that many perks because I don't want to overinvest. So I only have two out of two, and those are the best of those. Um, because there's other characters that I don't use just this loadout. But this is just such a strong loadout. Um, instead of this, let's go Spirit Fury, though. Now that they fixed it. And let's, let's get it, dude. Let's get it. I will be back once we're in game. Uh, okay, and here we are as clown. Uh, I really, oh, son of a f Okay. Uh, so as clown, what you want to do is you want to throw bottles and then you want to stab people. Or slice them. Or, or both, honestly. But the truth of the matter is, like, clown, he throws bottles and it makes them poison and cough a lot. And get... And get really annoyed because their screen gets all weird. Uh, he's one of the most obnoxious people to go against. They changed him so he can speed up or something. So if I throw that and then I catch up to it somehow. Oh, there we go. I go fast. That's a vote, boy. Yeah, I, I was so fast. I could. I could read their mind in the future. And I knew they went, I am because I saw them, you know. Oh okay, yeah, you have to reload your bottles. That's another thing. I just hurt someone right here.
Now we're gonna change it back to poison. I only see her. Hmm. Um, I've changed my rules a little bit. I'm allowed to tunnel twice, but I can't tunnel them to death because that means that they're able to be on edge and stuff. Uh, there in that situation specifically, I didn't really want to go for her, but I didn't see the other one. I don't know if anyone else did. If so, please let me know. Oh, hey, here's a Jane. We're going to use our speed up bottle there. Go down there. And bada bing, bada boom. So we're going to bring her back over here now. Her. For the hooker she is. Skank. Just kidding, I'm so sorry. You're beautiful. Um, pop goes the weasel. Reload. I keep looking for lockers to reload because of, uh, trickster and stuff. And now it's like a, it's a really bad habit. Okay. She doesn't make that. Not in a, not in a million years. There's someone right here. No. Well, if you guys get me, you get me. We're gonna put her here in the basement, but again, we have morals. We do not camp the basement. Again, I just tried to reload at the lockers because I am the biggest stupid it is oh. I you know sometimes when you wake up and you just you hate yourself. <laughs> That's how I feel. Well let's pop this and just reset it to nothing. <laughs> oh god. Oh, there's some people. There's a person there there's a people is what I should say. So I kind of run at this angle because I don't know which... Hey, what are you doing? What you doing, girl? Hmm. I might be able to kick this one because that that's uh the Claudette. And then me go this way and see if she's still over here because she's an idiot. Throw that right over. Oh my god, are you kidding me? I don't have any bottles left. Let's reload. It's gonna slow us down. I believe it used to. Yeah, it does. Thank you. Throw that in there. And then that. Nice. Nice. We did pretty good there. Reload our bottles. Break this pallet. Uh, did they drop the pallet over here? We still have pop goes the weasel for this. I forgot we even had spirit fury. I'll be completely. Did you just take her off the hook right there? 
Yeah, I assume they have to be running that way, right? Oh, you guys think I have morals? Oh, you dirty, disgusting humans. You actually think I have morals? No, I will slaughter all of you. Nice. God, I love that. Survivors who think that they just... They just deserve... They're like, I just got unhooked. I should never be attacked again for the next life state. <laughs> no, if you, un if you get unhooked right next to me, then, um... I'm gonna hit you down. What do you mean? <laughs> Anyways, if since nobody got I don't know what to say. I really don't know what to say. There we go. If we can get back to her and nobody picked her up, then I'll take her. But, no. Okay, there we go. She got picked up. I respect that, Chase. She did really well. I felt like it was kind of unfair because if I didn't have that door, there was no way I would have gotten her. Which one are you? The Derby fan? Uh, it's time for you to go, I think, dude. I can't just keep letting you go. I'm sorry, bud. I gave you another chance. Why was she whimpering if she wasn't injured? That's weird. Did you hear that too? Didn't it seem like she was whimpering while she wasn't injured? That was awfully strange. I think they're at that one. It's kind of hard to say. It's kind of hard to say, though. I know I saw someone running this way, but... Oh, there's the Jane. Oh, 
And uh, I think that's our clan game, dude. Canada, oh Canada. Oh, there's two people left. Where are you? I'm throwing gas everywhere. Did you make it this far? Screw you, dude. <laughs> Screw you and your stealth. My colorblind comes in as a handicap sometimes, my friend. Give me oh I can see that. I swear I just heard someone to my left. You like that Kobe though? Look at that. That was beautiful. That's why you are clawed at. Well, that's just how the cookie crumbles, eh? GG's that is a 4k I consider 4k if I let them go but anyways GG's there's no reason to like take away what 2500 blood points somebody minimum for no reason when you could just give it What do you think the next killer is? We just we just did a uh, pig. Now let's see who is it. Who is it? Spirit. You about you ready to see me get a zero? A zero K? What does this do? Scratch marks are no longer visible. I need that. 
dramatically increases haunting duration, slightly decreases haunting movement speed. That's fine. Considerably increases haunting activation charge. Speed. Wait, we gotta click on that one. Uh, considerably increases haunting movement speed. There you go, perfect. Uh, we'll grab the memento mori. Will we be able to use it? Probably not. Um, thrilling tremors. I don't know how good that is on her or not, but it looks like I don't have much else. Uh, maybe Rancor. Uh, Pop Goes the Weasel sounds pretty solid. Instead of Haunted Grounds, I'm thinking Corrupt Intervention just to give me a little bit of a. Do I have Strider? I know that's disgusting and I know people hate it, but like. I'm not good. <laughs> Can I buy a Strider right now? Yeah, let's let's just let's just see what the next tree is, you know? Let's just see what the next tree is. We don't gotta we don't gotta worry about what we're doing, okay? The next tree though might show a little bit of something something. That, you know, who knows what it could be. It could be a car, it could be a one once in a lifetime offer, who knows? Um I meant the tree after this, like the tree after this. Wow, that would have been that would be crazy. Oh, I should grab that noad. That'd be so crazy if there's something so amazing behind this next tree. I don't even know what it could be. It definitely wouldn't be Strider, but if it was there, of course we would take it because it's Strider. Life sucks. Okay. There is something though that we just picked up. What is this? Tremendously increases movement speed. Scratch marks are no longer visible. Okay. I think I'm content with this. This is gonna be one of my worst killers ever because um, people that don't know me, and I mean, I'm sure you barely have even gotten this far in the video, and if you have, you most likely have skipped to it, but nonetheless, people who don't know me don't realize that I have a really, really bad hearing disability where left is right, right is left, and sometimes up is like forwards and backwards instead of like up and down. So, games that require, um, like, focus on directions are really hard. Sometimes I hear things that aren't really there. It's not schizophrenic, but it's, uh, you can look it up. It's central auditory processing disorder. It just makes everything combobulated. Like, someone can be like, hey, how are you? And I'll hear, hey, get on the ground, boo. And I'm just like, well, that doesn't make any sense, does it? And I'm using a more calm example, but usually it's something very sexually charged and something very upsetting at the same time. Um, but that's just something to keep in mind that that's the reason I stay away from spirit. Um, if the game goes awful, I will play a second spirit game, but chances are this is going to be the only time I play spirit unless there's something else in the future. Either way, I will catch you once we are in the game. Alright, okay, here we are. We are spirit. Ooh! Ooh, so spooky! Okay. Um. Those are corrupt. Ah. Uh, this is gonna require 110% focus. I am going full gamer mode. Tell you what. And before one of those pop. Also, I'm really out of there's one.
There's a male back here. Unless Jane just sounds like hell. Man, it is so confusing to me. Uh, to make it up to you guys for whole like um, not do being able to do spirit if I can't pull this off Maybe I'll try to do a ag game that You know just a um, just a one time a level one I assume Trick works too often. Way too often. Hopefully we can pop this generator right here in time. There was another one, but I'm not exactly sure where they went. They're not in the lockers. Oh, interest. Okay. All right, let's make our way back to her. I feel bad that I can't like provide a great game for you guys right now. This is some good practice, at least. I don't really know what we're doing, but it's good practice, right?
This guy thought that it was gonna work twice. What a buffoon. I need him for Rancor though. Did I bring a, um, Mori? I feel like maybe I didn't. Oh, no, I had to have. Okay. I mean, I, I don't, I don't have to have, but you know what I mean? Okay, okay, okay. All right, all right, all right, all right. There goes your Jane. But that's big because now we can see where they all are. Actually, right sure it's this bitch that's running over here. No, I wanna, I wanna rancor you. <laughs> Please. Is that you? You think I'm playing with you, kid? You think I'm playing with you, kid? I know that the hatch is gonna open. I want it to open. I want it to give you false hope.
All right, well, I guess we have somebody that just wanted to get drunk and party. I, I guess there was no fun to be had there, darn it. Okay, anyways, what's our next killer? It is Legion. Oh, baby, my boy, Legion. Look at this. Ugh. God, he's so beautiful. We'll put him in that. We've got the modern Karambit ready up. Let's use the Jolly Rod. Uh, we're going to use Overcharge, Pop, Discordance, and Barbecue. Overcharge. Let's see what else there is for instead of Overcharge that maybe I want. Um, What are you thinking? Corrupt Intervention, Bamboozle. Brutal Strength. Ruin, Fired Up, Fire Up, Enduring. Hmm. Mad Grit could be fun. I think of like what would feel best as Nijin. Like, what would he have? I almost want to just try Shadowborn because it'll make us look faster, make us seem that like we're going faster, and that's what I'm going to do. Anyways, our attachments are going to be because we're going to use the best that we can that we want to. Uh, while using Feral Frenzy, the repair progress of generators can be determined by the intent. I'm going to take that because that's pretty useful. Uh, allows Feral Frenzies to considerably reduce the survivor's deep wound timer. Mildly decreases the deep wound timer for all survivors. Let's do that because it's really annoying. Um, and let's go to... Um, let's go to the game. I know a lot of people don't like the game, but for some reason, I just think the game's really fun. I think that they did a really good job on the Jigsaw map. In, no, 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 in, in, uh, let's go to Cold Wind, Cold Wind if it lets us. Let me back out. Let me check if we can do, um, Cold Wind now or if it's still busted. Yeah, that's not at all what I want. Uh. Maps disabled. Fix currently being worked on to maps okay yeah so let's just let's just do uh the game for now which is really really unfortunate because it's fun to play uh you know have i been have i been neglecting my challenge oh no no they don't come out for seven days what Kind of God. Sure. What am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to get my um you know that that head style? Alright. Let's get into it. You already know the build. We got Shadowborn Pop, Discord and some barbecue and chili. Two people get on a, a generator, we go in there, we stab them both. Barbecue and chili because we love blood points around here, boys. Pop goes the weasel because 25% off a generator, you know, pretty choice. And Shadowborn 15 degrees wider than normal makes it so that when we're using our ability, we're going to look like we're going even faster. And because, honestly, I feel like it should be base kit anyways, so it's kind of just one of those. When I can use it, I will. Um, if you didn't want to run that, I would say that these other three are really, really good together with him. Um, Surge is pot a potential. Uh, Thanatophobia is also because everybody's going to be injured all the time. Ruin, of course, is always a go-to. Um, let's see here. I don't think Haunted Grounds is that good. Uh, okay, so, wait, 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 enduring, uh, you reduce the duration of Palestines by 50%. For some reason, 
I've heard a lot of good things about this. I personally haven't tested it yet, though, so I don't want to comment on it. No, it is always going to be good on a killer. Uh, Bamboozle's very good because of when you're in your ability and you jump over the uh, windows, you're going to have a great time just blocking them. Nurse's Calling is okay, but not everybody heals against them. And uh, everything else is more just whatever you feel like having, you know? So anyways, I'll catch you in game. All right, Plague on the Pale Swamp. Let's see what we can do. Uh, we have Corrupt Intervention on those three because of the furthest. Four, three, four, whatever. Birds just went off over here. People don't have time to go to this one, but what we're going to do is we're going to take a wide angle into it because sometimes they just run by here. Uh, see if we see anything. Nope, not quite. How is she not? Did you see that? She went and she's not injured or she's not sick. That's some BS. Anyways, we're going to go to someone else. I'm just gonna get as much people sick as possible. She is also broken. She's gonna jump window. Okay. She was trying to go for a flashlight save. She goes back for her. That hard? Nope, no dead hard. All right, let's see. What what else we got going? We got two people that think that they are um, John Wick with their flashlights trying to come at me. Hit me. There you go. You should be almost completely sick. Street again. Really well done. You got me into bloodlust. Well played. 
There is a pallet here. You make it around once? That was awfully greedy. I think I heard him outside this way. Like they just keep coming like flies. Yeah, well, let's bring you over to this naughty corner and we're going to then go over to one of the other people. Seems like everybody's been a naughty, naughty boy around these parts. Look at him over there. He thinks he's safe. Little does he know. Keep looking. We have corrupt purge right now, which is good. But I don't know if we're gonna be able to keep, really do much with it. Cause I'm not finding anybody right now. Oops. Okay, time to go into the basement with you, my friend. Over to you. I think you went right. There you are. Out. Got two downs with that corrupt. Not bad whatsoever. Let's see what else there is on the map. What's going on? We got one, two people. Um, let's reset this since it's in the middle. I want to get people sick again. And they're heading over in this way.
think I set off those crows, so we're not gonna go that way. Now, if we are smart... No, not if we're smart, but... It'd be smart if we could figure out where they are. Let's grab some more corrupt... Uh, cor uh, corrupt whatever and head this way because we just heard the explosion. I heard them. Ah, I see where they went. Meg is so cheeky. Oh, she knows I am going for her now for that. Probably went into like a long curve. Yeah, there she is. She's up there. There she is. Get really up close and personal and get some puke on her. <laughs> Just for being annoying, you are going to get the hook. Now we have two people there. We have one person, I think, over there that's the Jake. The Jake hasn't been participating in the flashlight saves. I'm not really too worried about him. The other two are kind of annoying. I don't have whispers over here. I keep forgetting to check whispers. That's something you should keep up. Okay, so there's whispers here, so that means in like a 30 radius it's in here. They go in the middle, like mad lads. Yes. Look, Look at this. What is I thought that that totem was her. Whoops. Hello. You are confusing the heck out of me. Second. Oh my gosh, no auto aim by the way. No auto aim. Auto aim doesn't exist by the way. This is, she's running me pretty well. All things considered, she did pretty well. Did you see the Jake in the distance, by the way, just crouched out? That was cute. He's way over there. Yeah, 
wonder if he still is. You know how funny that would be if he's still over here? We'll get you. I don't know where the uh, Jake is, but that's all right. One person can get out. That's fine. This is a fun match. Lots of flashlights and none none worked. <laughs> all right. Wow, I don't see him. Oh, hi. You did have a flashlight, you skank. Bad. Did you have a flashlight? Maybe you didn't. I don't even know. I just saw a crow. There they are. It's something I'll always be looking out for is crows in the distance because that'll really tell you if they've just left or if they've just gotten there. Um... Did she go up, left, or what? Okay. And that is game. Well. <laughs> there goes Plague. Next one is Ghostface. Let's go, dude. What is up, my baby? The very first killer that I ever really fully invested into. Ghostface here. P3 face, because why not with the Ghostface scream outfit and a knife to boot? This guy is very basic, and then he was who I grinded to rank, to rank one, and I would never advise it for anyone. He's got some weird bugs going on. I hope that they fix, but either way, he is a lot of fun. So hopefully I can showcase a little bit of what he has to offer. Um, I One little disclaimer, I do not use his ability almost ever. I guess maybe I would if there's like a group of three that are on a generator in the distance. But for the most part, it seems like I get their bars to 90%. I chase after them and then I have to wait for my power to come back. And it's just a really wait, big waiting game. And, and in the end, people just pop gens left and right. So I like to go for more of a let's just stab everybody and run away build. I think it works really well. Um, so we have uh, I'm All Ears, we have Barbecue and Chili, we have Pop, and we have Ruin. Um, what I'm going to do though is I'm going to drop Pop and I'm going to put Thanatophobia in I believe. Uh, just to have it a little, a little bit different. And we're going to drop I'm All Ears for... Haunted grounds because who knows maybe that could be a little bit of fun right? um, Let's go to the game and Just which everyone not meaning for cover moderately increases movement speed while crouched perfect Let's see. Do we want to change our face classic ghost face. We could go with the class We're gonna go with a p3 to go off we Got a few different outfits, but they all have like these dangly bits that make it hard to hide from people this one feels the most it's the best. Right now. 
uh, and I use the Damascus steel clip knife because it just like it would a lot and it's scary it's spooky like a CSGO knife unboxing but anyways I will catch you in the game hopefully we're able to get some good kills hopefully I'm able to showcase a little bit of what how I play ghost race and anyways I will see you in a moment awesome one of my favorite maps the jigsaw map the game let's go all right so we've got Got a lot going on here. Okay, someone's over here. Bus is down. What we can get. Yeah, let's just get her to drop it. <laughs> that is a uh, very good timing. Look at us, we are haunted ground gamers. Two kills for haunted grounds though? Pretty nutty. This person's injured, so we don't need haunted grounds. Bum ba dum 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 ba dum. Look at that! I heard ya. Oh, was I tunneling you? I apologize. There's someone else running right over here though.
Just give him a little bit of a teabag back, you know, you gotta. I don't need to break no pallets, you just gonna die, friend. Okay, that's our fourth. Let's see, do we see anyone? Oh, we do right above. But I scared her. Heard someone breathing over here. Very unfortunate. One thing with killers, you it, it's risky, but you want to try to guess where they're going to go from the pathing. Like, uh, once you understand how it works, once you know the layout of the map, you want to try your best to try to cut them off. It's not always going to work. Sometimes you're just going to fail horribly, but every once in a while. All right, let's see if she has decisive. Now we hit her to make her think we're going that way, but we're gonna go this way. Next one up. We're gonna break this and we're gonna go pick them up. And see, this is how I like playing Ghost Face. I don't like to mark things. I think marking just takes too much time and is too inconsistent. You can mark somebody to 90% and then if you hit them because they're body blocking, you just lose it. Now if you look at the look at the bottom left corner, I now have what three six nine I have like fifty two hooks, I think it is. Something like that. And um can't do that, okay. Okay. 
Now they both fell downstairs, so I'm gonna... work but it's not quite enough mm, she makes it to that but that's not a safe one Let's just grab a hold of them. And I'm going to hope that we see him. Thank you, found hatch. Ah! And that's how you play yeah. Ghostface. Easy peasy lemon squeezy just like that merciless killer my baby a baby ghost face. Let's go dude uh, Let's see if they have anything to say they probably don't but Nope their console all right, so our next killer we'll be right back with Yo, what is up? It is time for Demogorgon. Let's get up into this. We already recorded this one time. However, we ran into a problem where our internet lost connection for some reason, and it gave us a 30-minute cooldown timer. So with Demogorgon, this shows that we are close to the end in terms of our challenge. I was just, during our 30-minute, I was doing a, a little snippet, and we are basically at four hours long of a video. And I know that seems like a long time, but I am going to have timestamps so you can just see the killers that you care about. If you care to watch this far, I absolutely adore you and I love you. And you know, honestly, if I had the money, I'd give you some. I'd give you. A, I'd give you a fiver, but I don't. So you're gonna have to deal with it. Anyways, Demogorgon is one of my weakest killers. He is easily one of my weakest killers, and I I know I'm going to make people that know how to play Demogorgon incredibly upset with how I play him because I just don't know what I'm doing. I uh, I forget to check portals. I just I just don't play him right. I play him like a normal killer would be. Um but nonetheless I hope we get some good results and I will see you as soon as we are in the game. Our next killer is Oni. 
Now I'm not gonna make you sit through the loading screen because this is all he does. He just hits things really angrily and it's really annoying. I used to be really good at Oni, but I stopped playing him for a long time. I'm not that great with him anymore. Nonetheless, this is gonna be our build. It is the staple build, the nurses, infectious fright, pop, and barbecue and chili. As for add-ons, let's see, what is there? Um, survivor coming in, blah, 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 blah. Considerably decreases consumption penalty of blood free while dying a survivor. That one sounds good. And um, let's do moderately increases movement speed. Why not, right? Oh no, let's do passive. Yeah. And we're going to bring him more in case we get a chance to more. And we're going to try to more as many people as possible if we are able to. Mind you, again, I've been playing so much survivor that now my killer skills are a little bit lacking. Uh, rank 11, by the way. Ha ha! Okay, I'll see you in the game. Alright, here we are on Crotus Print Asylum as demo. We are right next to a generator. Let's put a portal here so that maybe we can try to spook someone if I ever remember to check it. Let's look around, keep our eyes open. The thing is, a lot of people like to take it very slow at the beginning of maps. They'll always be looking at outskirts because it's so rare that they're spawn elsewhere. It's absolutely wonderful. They missed a skill check. They ran this way. We saw the scratch marks. And there she is. So now let's make our way chasing her. We just saw a crow. Unless I'm seeing things. We don't absolutely need to stick to her. Also because I lost her because I looked down on my phone because I'm a disgusting human being that does things other than the game. Those are f this fire. A lot of them like to work on this one because it's in the open. There we go. We got a good shred and she turned the corner. Let's jump over. Let's just do a loop. I think she's already dead hearted, so there we go. And Sir just pops that generator. Uh, is basement here? It is not. So we're gonna put her on here. We're gonna, we don't have barbecue and chili, which sucks. So what we're gonna do is we're just gonna go, we're just gonna hope. Um, I know people were working on that one before. Let's listen for this one as we go through. It's kind of being worked on. Someone's been up here. I think that scared her. Okay. I don't want to put her in the basement early on this, but I don't, I don't know. This is a pretty far run. I see them healing at the bottom of that, which I do not like. Okay. Turn back this way. She thinks that she's fancy, so she's trying to do all these fancy maneuvers. And that's how you put someone down. I'm going to leave her there because of potential DS. Actually, you know what? She dead hearted and she kind of felt cocky. I don't think she has DS. Maybe.
We don't have time to really mess around too much. So we put a portal way over there. We're gonna put another portal here and we're gonna go to that one. How do we... There we go. It's me. We need to put another one over here. Like right here. Okay, better murmur. There's someone there, and that's all I know. Would you look at that? Now, unfortunately, I don't like to tunnel, but the thing is, I'm going to. But we're not going to stick for too long. Okay, let's look for a generator that's being worked on because we only have two left. Demo is so weak for me. I don't know why. I just cannot get him down. There is Demo Gorgon doing what he does best, which is basically nothing. They're probably over at that one, if we're gonna be honest. Now we're gonna go back over to those ones. You know I got no head, right? So, unfortunately, Noah is kind of the MVP of this match for in terms of hooks. Not sure about deaths yet, but you know hooks.
Big someone got someone off a of hook. Here are two of them up here. That hard. Okay, let's go back over here. No Ed, no problem. Where would I hide if I were them? Where would I be hiding? They're trying to get that gate open. Oh well, two for two, I'll take it. Two for two, I will take it for a character that I never play. There we go, there's Demo. I'm sorry, I know it's disgusting, everybody hates no ed players, but I don't even have any other perks that there is at my disposal. Let me send better murmur and search. Come on, guys. Give me a little bit of a break, will you? Anyways, our next killer, let's see what it is. Yeah, okay, so here we are. I, I didn't see what the name of the map is. Can we see an escape? Uh... Macmillan Estate Ironworks. All right. So basically, Oni has a very unique situation to him. He is a very, very weak killer until you get that first M1. Once you get the M1, you're pretty good because you start building up the blood. And the blood allows you to charge your power, which makes you a stronger... Uh, stronger than, than probably most killers. Um, he's kind of hard to control, though. And by kind of, I mean he is very hard to control. You just can't, people just can't allow that. Or, you people just can't allow, um, you to get the M1. There's the M1. We're gonna take that blood though. And we're gonna go this way. Catch up to her again in the weird way. 
There we go. She's gonna jump that. We're gonna go this way to block off her fast vault location. Uh, it looks like she just kept running instead. So, sees, it shows how much I know about this video game. Um, she's just running me for a loop. She's just running, holding W. What we're gonna do is we're gonna make our way back town this way. If we see that David again, that'd be really nice. Hmm. Weird. I guess when I heard him fall right here. His punching animation is so satisfying to watch though. Go over to this generator. Maybe he's over here popping this one. There he is. And there's his power. We're gonna keep it at as high as possible, so we're gonna pick them up immediately. We're gonna go this way, and we're gonna hook over on there. Suck up their blood. And because we saw a generator pop this way, we're gonna kind of make our way this way. See what we have going on. Looks like we might have someone healing. Nope, that's just the blood that they left. Use their power and try getting a gist of what's going on on the map. pick up him this basement oh it is basement oh you guys messed up you guys messed up you got cocky for the bakaki and now here you are you're messed up all right so we got david down in the basement uh not seeing anybody in barbecue but i did just see a crow land there so it's possible that somebody is on their way at the moment potentially already in the basement Now, David thinks I'm going for him, but I'm actually going for Nancy. Just kidding, Meg. Basically anyone I can reach. <laughs> I think I just heard David in front of me. Pop that. break this she knows what she's doing Nancy's probably their best player but because she
she's their best player. We're going to kind of keep an eye on her. Because she's going to want to babysit her. Just take a look at all of the different generators really quick. Damn it. My mouse just fell off the key off my uh, desk. So there is a chance to come back with Oni, even when it's like this, when you find a spot like that. Now, it's very unlikely, but if we can make it there. Okay, that's going to be three people. Maybe. Assuming David just runs away. I don't even remember really seeing David other than him just being saved. That sucks for him. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. There we go. And there we go. 
Not a 4K, but it's a 3K, and I'll take it. There we go. GG. I'll take it. I think I just heard the hatch up there. Yeah, I did. <laughs> I don't think I, yeah, I wouldn't be able to reach that. Yeah, okay, so here we are with Deathslinger. Let's go, baby. We got the Deathslinger with the with the with the yellow on them or gold or whatever you want to say. Uh we've got Rancor, Modern Abuse, No Ed, and uh the other thing that's a retribution thing. I don't have perks for this guy. I'm sorry. Um I am also not the best shooter in the world. I play a lot of shooters, but not like this type of shooter. Um it's just I, uh, I fail a lot. So please bear with me. Why can I see everyone? Is that an add-on? I don't think so. But nonetheless, this is Deathslinger, and let's do as best we can. Hopefully we can get a Rancor going. I'd really like to see the death. Um, last game, I think I could have, and I completely forgot my Mori wasn't last game it's happened definitely a couple times lately now let's see i feel like someone ran this way but i could be wrong uh yeah okay i think they all just split up that way Doesn't matter who I hit, they all think that they're the best. Now we can ignore him. Let's listen for this. We don't hear anything. They probably all ran straight to the next one. Okay, we don't see anything there. Do they go to the place everybody likes to go to? They do, they're way too predictable. <laughs> nice drop of the pallet there. Was able to bait that pretty easily. Now what we're gonna do is we're going to actually look in there. Don't see anyone. Just fine. Got one gen done. I should have broken that pallet. I'll break it next time. That could cost me dearly. I don't mind that generator. It's way too far away to check. This generator I actually did care about. 
Wait, they're not done with this generator. I can actually stick to this guy a little bit. No, we don't have time. We gotta go back upstairs. They're about to pop this, but we might be able to trade one for one. gonna hit it not gonna do much but we'll hit it no noise there he's making a noise over there he wants my attention I swear a lot of the people who play this game are just children that really want attention that generator going is fine. Unfortunately, the generator up there is not. Break this. I'm up the stairs. Oh my god, we can't get up that way. That might have just cost us it. They're gonna get this generator. It's just what generator else are they gonna be going for? going for us but if I was them I would be running around the long side here but I'm not them those just landed we're gonna head right back I don't know where any of them are over to this generator I think that they're probably about to pop it okay LT wall not my greatest friend hard
Okay. Well, these guys wanted to do a meme, but I, I, I hate Steve, so it doesn't really change much for me. They think cute, I think annoying. We just have to wait. Next time they die, if I see them. Take a look at these gens real quick. This is David. Take him up, see if he has decisive. Now we're going to head right back over to that generator. Dead hard. Nope. Super laggy. I'm putting you in the basement because of how laggy you are, sir. I'm sorry. I'm not gonna camp you, but dang, dude. I want to, I want to mori him. I'm going to go over to this generator and see what's going on.
Come on. But he didn't want me to rancor him. Alright, well that was Deathslinger. Super fun and engaging play. Yeah, oh, what a loser. Uh, I, like, I don't even care because I'm not here to just bring in happiness all around. But honestly, if you're going to go into a pre-made with a bunch of the same outfit and then you're going to try to trash talk after because you got hatched after getting slugged twice, you're a complete loser. You're actually just a loser. Congratulations, dude. You made yourself out to be a complete idiot. It didn't even matter to me that much, and it still doesn't because it was Death Slinger. I just thought it would be fun to get a Rancor out. Uh, clearly I should have just hooked him immediately like his friend who instantly disconnected because you know neither none of them could handle a Deathslinger that never plays Deathslinger. Nonetheless though, rant over. It's time for our next killer. Yo, we are back and I think this is Bad Ham Preschool. We've got Monitor and Abuse, we've got Overcharge, we've got um, the other thing and Barbecue and Chili. Let's see if we can do anything here. We got the uh, Steve down. I think there's one more person on the generator over there, so we're gonna head our way over there. Blow it up. Thank you. Now we have overcharge because we are lacking uh, both ruin and um, pop. 
So therefore we need to make do with what we can and overcharge believe it or not is a pretty decent budget version of these You just go back on this what the heck? Okay, so basically a lot of people don't expect it and so it'll help. Oh, I think that's the one that makes me invisible Ooh. Or if I can get a sneaky hit off awesome. That way See right there she was able to um She blew up the uh the skill check because nobody runs it it's such a weak perk because once you know how that's going to come, a lot of times people can just handle it. But the first time, second time, it's a pretty strong perk. It really, really is. Where the heck did you go? What the crap? They vanished in front of my eyes. So we're gonna pop this and we're gonna get our... I guess we're not gonna get our invisibility quite yet, but... We're gonna make our way back to this generator because for some reason they have a hard-on for it. You go at it a slightly different angle though. There we go. Now they can't spot us. Where are you? Now they can't spot us. Or, well, they can spot us. I'm not quite sure what it does. I think it gets rid of my stain. It makes it so my music's gone, so I'm kind of stealthy. This is lit up for them. Uh, I see a barbecue zone way over there. Maybe we can sneak our way up into there. I wonder if we can get cheeky, like, little... That's going to be loud. Oh, no, they know. They're aware. Fine, God pal out of the way. And you jumped out this way, huh? Okay, okay. Are you gonna drop that instantly? Yes, you are. Not. I don't know what my add-on does, by the way. Um, it was just already in there. I had to go to the bathroom, and when I came back, it, it, this was what was set. I'm pretty sure, though, these are the best build. This is the best build that I could come up with at the time, and that's why it's running it. Because usually, I would not be running these together. But it's a fun build. It's not great. It doesn't have great control, but it gives a little bit of like uh, knowledge, a little bit when they mess up. And it helps you kind of be stealthy around the map. It's not the worst at all. I'd be happy if we can get a 2k out of this. Oh, hey, look, it's Steve. Meow. Night. He came back out this way anyways, though. Dead hard. No.
Go back over here. I don't know if we make it to basement anymore because of that, but I think that's worth it. We do. Sweet. Definitely worth it. And we see two people over there. They're not working on gens at the moment. Okay. One, two. Looks like that one will find a gen before that one, so we're gonna go for this one. There they are. Nice. I cannot hit that ability. It's why I stopped playing him too. It's just I can't hit the ability, I'm bad. So I'm curious, do you think the other one's going for the save or hiding? Oh, they went for the save. What? 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 What just happened? What just happened? I need to, I need to rewatch that. I need to rewind. They had to be going for the save any second, but what the heck? Oh, there's someone. There we go. Damn, we got that person over there. They're injured. I think I can actually slice them. I think this might be their death hook, which would be great to get a Mori out of here. No. Unfortunate. Never lucky. Oh well, that was a quick 4k and we need some faster games around here, so... I will take a 10 minute game. GG. Now mind you, Pyramid Head is not the greatest for me. However, he has an ability that allows him to do that. It's people through walls. It's very good. This torment allows him to teleport people. This was not a great showcase of him. However, if you are a Pyramid Head fan, absolutely invest in him. He is fun. He's just not my play style. Let's go to the next killer. All right, so we are back with Blight this time. Uh, we are... I don't really know too much about Blight, like how to play him very well, honestly. Um, I think this is going to go barbecue if I have it. I do not. So let's just go with the full... Let's go with this. So we've got Undying, Ruin, and Haunted Grounds so that at least no matter what, we will have Ruin or uh, Haunted Grounds twice. It's very good. Very, very good. Blade Wrap moderately increases rush speed for each consecutive rush. That's pretty good. And this makes it so that when I get close to people that are doing stuff, it gives them a hard skill check. Um, I think I'm going to upgrade this, though, into the undetectable status while rushing. And I think we're going to grab a Mori. Mind you, all these games that I brought, all these best of best in slot things, um, haven't really been used. I think there was one that I was able to, right? Uh, Bubba, because I play Bubba. I know how to use him. But um, Blight, is, on the other hand, is not that sort of character. So I would be lucky to get one. 
one Mori off, but I think Moris are really cool. So, you know, if you're going to get down twice the third time, you might as well just accept the Mori. So anyways, I will see you as soon as we get back in game. Thank you so much. It's very appreciated. Yo, what's up? We're back at the same map, but that's okay. We're blight. Let's go. Be One thing. Oh, okay. I guess. I guess I couldn't go that far, but nonetheless, let's see if we spot anyone. Okay, I really thought that would have hit. Nope, I didn't mean to left click. There we go. He has a uh, calm spirit, it sounds like. And what is that? That was our Undying. We still have... No, that was our Haunted Grounds. We know where they were. Dun, dun. That's weird, there's like a wall you get stuck on there. But Michael, Haunted Grounds is for noobs. Yeah, well, I'm a noob. Oh, you skunk. What? Ignore that, that was embarrassing. See if they have decisive. They do not. Still have ruin. We have whispers over here too. Thought we could just kind of smash through it. There goes my whispers, or there goes my um, unfortunate hex run. Whatever. She doesn't make this. Nice. I didn't know you couldn't swing if you uh, didn't bounce off anything. Kind of a weird mechanic. But here we go, there is Nancy. Nancy wheelchair. Two gens down. Oh, we can't even go that way. We'll go this way instead. 
Now we have no perks, mind you, because they got rid of our perks really fast. It that. Go back down to here. Come back here. Okay, there's the Jake. Thought we were after the bill, but you know, it works. Get him out of the game. And then let's make our way back to, oh no, I didn't make it. Okay, whatever. Make our way back down this way. And we can just hit this. This new blight change is kind of nice, eh? You're able to see so much. mouse. Hit my phone, I mean. Yeah. Okay. There's the Nancy again. Not bad, not bad. I didn't even see her. I just heard the music and the red kept coming. You like how I play my killers? I literally am just an M1. Really? Nancy got saved. Dead art? No. Okay. Now we're gonna go pick her up. Put her on this hook. Go for the bill. I'm glad he went that way because it's kind of blocked off. Mm, I messed up. I went a little bit too deep into that. 
Did I break this yet? Of course not. His medkit didn't disappear. So he doesn't have, um, Styptic Agent. And that's all of them. Did I use my ability? Probably not. Alright. There we go. One down. <laughs> I like using him to rush from point A to point B. But I'm not a fan of anything else. Apparently I need to find Hatch because he ran off. Unless I'm just blind. Whispers, 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 whispers over here. Whispers there. Is he in the house? I'm not hearing him for some reason. like half tempted to just dip and try to find the hatch for him. I feel bad when someone slugged this long. Oh, he died. Whoops. I'm gonna bring that up to him.
Ah, oh, he's a PC. Whatever. Screw him. Screw his console. Next killer. Let's go. We're almost done. We are at the final run. We are at the final run. There's only one killer left after this one. This one is a, uh, a sexy little swamp woman with her little boy. You could call her the MILF. The MILF of the entire DBD community. Her name is Charlotte. She has a son named Victor. And it's time to try our best to get as many kills as possible, but also to have fun. Remember, this is a game. Have fun. Winning is what you make of it. And for me, I don't like to try hard too much to get the 4K every time. It's not fun. For you, that might be different. But let's see how we do. Okay, so here we are. We got the really, really bad Charlotte thing. So I'm not sure with Charlotte. I've only played her a couple times. I just put points into her from uh, doing this sort of like video. If you're supposed to be using Victor immediately or use her. To find them. And I'm not very far from that. Nice. Okay, so let me explain the build a little bit. It, it's, it's, a, it's not a great build. But basically, we have Coupe de Gras, which makes it so that every hook... Let me see if that gives a point. I want to say it's every hook makes it so that we can um, launch ourselves 40% faster. We have the regression perk, which is pretty nice. Um, and that makes it so that when we hit one, multiple can go down. And if uh, somebody is busy, like if somebody um, is on a gen already, they get a hard skill check showing up to them. Um... Brutal strength so we can, you know, brutally break things. Brutally. And, um... Hmm. Uh, Spear Fury is Spear Fury. So let's get Victor back out because we know that there's an ace over in this area. See if we can take him down real quick. This map is too big for her Charlotte to run around. Unfortunately. Okay, it's over there. I kind of like that you can see the white. Uh, it looks like she already got it off her though. Oh no, it's just if I get close enough, it goes off. So I didn't use any of my points there because um, I didn't charge for Coup de Gras. It's a very, very underrated perk though. And I would say that you should definitely try it out on some killers. It's pretty wild. When it works, it works. Let's kick this so that multiple get regen. And we're gonna unbind Victor. We're going straight over to where we just saw this explosion. Ah, 
Now we're gonna go over to him. Make him a little annoyed. I wish that she was a little bit faster, but if she was faster, then she would just be a really good M1 killer, right? So it, it wouldn't work. So we got Coup de Gras. Is it every time a generator is done? Maybe that's how it works. There we go, Coup de Gras. I used one of the points so I could launch. If, do you see how far it went? Really, really good. Really, really good perk. Not exactly sure what these guys are doing. I think they're a little bit confused. They're lost. They're scared. They're afraid. Uh, Coupe de Gras. See how far that is? That's wild. I didn't need to use it there, but I wanted to showcase just how crazy far it is. And most survivors never expect it. Even if you're uh, Charlotte, they're not going to expect it because it's just something so small. So we're going to go over here and we are going to try getting out of range of that so that we can unbind Char on Victor and let's go back over here. Okay, perfect. They didn't kick it. So now we're gonna go into we're gonna go pick up the ace, who I believe the Fang was with. So we might not be able to get him in time, but that will reset the timing of the healing, and I'm not sure who is more healed, Ace or Fang. I guess it was Fang since she's fully healed. put her up on the hook she had a little cheeky tea bag there because I guess she didn't know that there was a huge hole there that she was gonna try to loot me in um, but nonetheless now this is where it's gonna start getting a little bit well I was gonna say because I don't know where anybody is but I guess I do know where people are and because of that cheeky tea bag we got oh. there we go Okay. Okay. That's a lot of value. Pick up the ace. Put him on the hook. And we know one went this way. I kind of run at an angle like this so I can try to see as many angles as possible. I hear this being worked on. So... Has this been recent or has this been later? I'm not quite sure, but it's time to head back. Oh no, I lost my prey. That just opened up. That was really weird. That was creepy. Alright, so let's just go patrol the gens for now. Oh, there's someone.
Now we shall go over to that gen because we know there's two people there. And we don't necessarily have to knock her out immediately either. What we can do is we can go here because we know there's a Meg as well. And if we kick this with real strength, it's now going to go across the board to the other gens. I wonder if she went into here. Nope. I wonder if she went back to this. No. Okay, it looks like they're healing up. Smart move. That crow just landed. They're over here. Now I have Coop to grab, but I'm not going to use it yet. What I'm going to do is I'm going to kick this, and then I'm going to take out Victor, and I'm going to try to take him out. No? Weird. Maybe she panics with it and keeps running. She does. I think I can make this before anything can happen over there. We still have a couple gents to work with. Yeah. I think I'm going to coop this. There we go. Because the gen popped, I still have one coop de gras, which is really, really good. And since she's dead, now we're going to take a few steps away and we're just going to unbind Victor and run straight back over to that gen they were working on before. Uh, there's the one person going for it. There's Hatch right there. Okay, now we just gotta go over there, take care of her. <laughs> Fun twins gameplay, if I do say so myself. Okay, um... We're going to unbind Victor once we can, and we're going to go to the furthest gen. Which is being worked on. But there's two people there, so I can't do too much. I need to run over there myself with uh, Charlotte. One is busy, though. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I, maybe I just misheard, but I could have sworn I heard a second one here. Uh. Okay. Well, let's hide her here and let's bring him over here like this. I hear her. No, that's a fire. That being worked on or is that sparking? That's sparking. He healed, so I wonder if she healed like over here. Okay. Where is that? Is that it? The little white dot thing over there. Okay. Let's go, uh, let's go there. Actually, we just got Victor back. Let's just 
knock her down with Victor. It's kind of going to be faster than trying to find her, yeah? see sparks anymore someone's here That's kind of close by too. Let's go for it. That's still sparking, so we should be fine. There he is. We don't need to keep this. Let's go find her now. Now, I know this is lame, but this is kind of how they want you to play Charlotte. Okay. I'm gonna go close the hatch. Find Victor, and we're gonna try to find her. Which side do you think she went to? That gate or that gate, huh? Probably that gate, huh? Oh, I don't see anything. Unless she has a key. And there we go, there's our Charlotte game. GG guys, GG. Sorry if about the slugging, but you kind of have to slug a bit with her because of the travel time. Merciless killer. Let's go. GG's. Oh, rank system, please. Okay. Uh, so I think we have one more killer, and that's. Trickster. My boy. My wonder. The love of my life. Trickster. Let's go. 
Okay, so we got the Pren Asylum, and our final perk was bamboozle so that we can boozle the bams. And by that, meaning block off paths so that they don't expect it, maybe. This map, mm, okay for it, I guess. And then, no. I wish I had a different perk for this map, but that's okay. Let's see if we can spot anybody. Oh, we see someone in the far distance. Let's see if we can kind of keep it... Okay, well, blades it is. <laughs> blades it is. We're back. Man, a generator is already popped. I wish Jens had like a 20 second more like leeway on it, but whatever. Go. I'd being sneaky, but I don't know where he went. Okay, so one thing with Trickster, I know that I'm doing bad right here, but I do think his best route is to make them injured like that and then just melee. I think that's like his by far best route because when you're doing that and they start to sprint you're able to take back and you're able to swing almost immediately pretty helpful I shouldn't have brought him over here because this is kind of where ruin is we need to get more blades so we're gonna go inside And Trickster is by far one of my favorite characters aesthetically and just because I think his playstyle is really fun and I think most people should try giving him a shot. I don't like camping but I will look because people like to think that for some reason because you hook somebody all of a sudden you should just be out of the area immediately. Um, and that's not the case. <laughs> you know? It's just not the case. Break this. Might need to later. Okay, two explosions. Interesting. Okay. They're working on this generator. Or they blew it up. That or maybe they threw a pebble? Not sure. By the way, let's go check out this generator over here. Everybody's pretty injured. Nope, oh, no noise there. So they must be in the middle building, maybe upstairs. This here coughing, but I talked over it. Dead, you motherfucker. <laughs> eh? <laughs> I have a bad habit of wanting to use my blades too much now, I think. <laughs> But that's okay. This means I'll get better with them over time. What I'd really like is barbecue and chili, so I have an idea as to where I'm supposed to be going. Been kind of tough trying to figure it out. Now we're going to head back to her. Nobody's up there. We're going to reload. Everybody's injured. Make our way back to him because I think there's two people working on that generator, but I'm not completely sure. There might actually be someone on that generator right now. 
No? Okay. The sense that she got saved, we're gonna go this way, see where they go. They probably dropped off the back way. Interesting. We're following these scratch marks. I lost them. That's unfortunate. You hate to see it. You really do. Here, I'll put you in the naughty corner over here. <laughs> I think we can knife him. Man, he booked it. <laughs> he booked it. That guy was out of there, dude. Oh, geez, that's funny. All right, well, Bill, I'm sorry. Where are you? Here are you. Are you even the same bill? Oh, did you get up for my breakable? I was trying to pick you up. I was wondering what was going on. Alright, so we want to make it... We want to walk by this one. But go through here to see if we hear it upstairs. We kind of do. Get that. Nobody's on that generator, nobody's on that one, nobody's on that one. They might either be A, looking for Ruin, or B, trying to play for Hatch at this point in the game. Stand up here and look. Dangle. They're healing! You scumbags! Okay. So they got saved over here. By who? There's two people left. Hmm. Someone's upstairs. If this gen's being worked on over here, maybe? Hmm. 
Oh, he's up there. Yeah, that's a nice key you got there, buddy. What kind of color key is it? He wiggled off as a bell. Oh well. We got the 4K. Might as well just give him hatch though. Let's see. What a great run, though. We went through every single killer in a day. We played each of them. I know they weren't all 4Ks. I know they weren't all good. Some went really poorly. But, you know, as an average player, you got to remember, not everyone is going to get all the 4Ks. And this is to show you can still have fun. You can still do well just because you haven't killed all four. This is a showcasing of sorts of each of the killers that are currently available in Dead by Daylight. I will update as time allows. I don't know where he went. I'm going to speed past this. Don't worry. I'm not going to keep this in. He is getting out. I promise you. Also, I don't know if it's been anybody else's noticed, but there's been like a little giggling noise out in the game. Maybe I'm just on drugs though. Come on, come on, come on.
Dude, there's that little giggle noise. Interesting. I wonder if that's a Resident Evil thing. Anyways. We did it. Alright guys, so I wanted to make a video that I thought was going to take about two hours but it ended up taking a lot longer where we went through every single killer back to back to back to back to back in one day just to, you know, kind of see where they all stood in my opinion. Now obviously this is so anecdotal, some games were good, some games were awful um and we were able to play all four, seven, eleven... 15, 19, and 22 killers that there are in the game. Um, because for some reason this is the, this is here, but this was I I don't know why this is a this is in the game. This isn't like a they don't do anything. They're just disgusting. But anyways, guys, I really appreciate you checking it out. I'm gonna make sure there's timestamps. I'm sure you've probably used a timestamp as well if you did end up going through the video. Mind you, I am not an amazing player, okay? I know I'm ranked 10 right now, but that was from the Trickster Challenge. I would say that I am a very average red rank player. I do not play for uh, to win. I do not play for 4Ks. I do not play for 3Ks. I play for 2Ks. I believe it's the most fun if killers are able to get two kills and still be challenged and have two people escape. I think that makes it a pretty fair and balanced uh, overall experience, and I think it's a lot of fun. I don't think you need to make somebody's life miserable just because you want that extra kill for what? How much blood points you get? Not much. Anyways, though, again, I'm going to be doing a lot of content, DVD related and other games as well, but I really appreciate you, and no matter where you are, no matter what you're doing, no matter what time zone you are in, I hope you're having a blessed day, and I hope you are safe. Tell your loved ones and everybody else that you love them. Take care, folks. Until next time.